properly. It came with its girl. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. So on this fine, beautiful, sunny morning, this is a bit of a different one. So we decided to have a day out on the bikes today and Ben decided to ask me to check my MOT. Sadly, it ran out yesterday without me knowing. So we're stuck with Ben's bike today and me on the back. Um, but yeah, it's a lovely day for it. So that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> you have a nice coffee then? Yeah, are you getting on the back? No. Why? Uh, just, I feel like I want to probably try and get home. I'm a, I'm a good rider, especially with people on the back. Yes, I've heard. I don't chuck people off. No. On the top of the A1. No. <laughs> it's horrible sitting on the back of this. Yeah, I bet. What? Well, that was our little ride out today. Um, just something a little, little bit different. Yeah, it's a shame about my bike, but it weren't too bad on the back of the R6, to be fair. Was it not? I just think my knee's gone numb because it's that bent yeah. on the back. Yeah, mine get like that on it as well. But it was a bit numb. So, but tomorrow... Get my got... bike in for MLT. And? And the lorry. The lorry is going for <laughs> MOT tomorrow, so... When you see us next, we'll be on our way to collect the truck and take it for the MOT. So we'll see how that goes. Happy Monday, guys. So today is the day where we've just picked the truck up. We're on our way to Peterborough to take it for its first MOT since we've owned the truck. Um, fingers crossed she passes, but we've been told she's in good nick and we shouldn't have any problems. So yeah, we'll see you when we get there. There's only one thing I'm not happy about and they've took all my stickers off the windows. So I'm gonna have to get some more made. My little only friend, only friends <laughs> sticker. It's gone. Um, so yeah, need another one. I don't know if you feel nervous, but I definitely feel nervous. Even though like, it's told us that everything's fine, I just know it's, I just feel nervous. I feel like I'm going for my, my driving test or something. I don't know, I feel like it's had a lot of work done. Like this truck, in the three months we've had it, it's been pulled to bits. If there was anything major, I'm sure we would have Oh yeah, no, he's, he's confident that we shouldn't have any issues and they've crossed the T's and dotted the I's. So. The only thing he said that was quite worrying is that this place we're taking it to, he said they are extremely in all about things. Um, which, I mean, you've got to be, I guess, but... I suppose they all are, really. 
apparently these ones are particularly anal. So if we if we pass them, we know it's good. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he's, they've replaced the front spring bushes, which is obviously a big job because of the way this truck's built. To get one of the bolts out, you have to take the diesel tank off, which is just insane. But as is lots of things on and vehicles. What, what, what state were they in? Oh, they were worn through pretty much. I'll, <laughs> I'll drop a picture of the old spring bushes here now so you can have a look at them. And they, they were just worn right Rotten. through. Yeah. <laughs> so it's got fresh ones in now. Had to have a new um, mid, middle axle steering arm as well. Look at this idiot. So I had to have a new near side headlight because when they went to adjust it to get the pattern right they realised the back of the headlight had been damaged, looks like it's been an accident. Yeah, um, he's, I think he said he's pretty certain oh, so, he, he said he's pretty certain that this truck has had an accident on this driver front corner. Yeah, it's probably point. had a little dock at some point. So on Friday well, this was Thursday night we found this out, and then on Friday, because they couldn't deliver one in time, um, I had to drive to, where did I go to? Rotherham. Yeah, Rotherham. I had to drive to Rotherham Friday morning to collect this part. Got it. This headlight, and then get it dropped off to the guys in the workshop. They've also replaced these top mirrors here, because they've gone a bit, Funny in the corners, the old ones. Oh, is that why it's moved? I didn't yeah, know he yeah. replaced them. Yeah, he's replaced them. He's also had to bolt some extra wide um, bits onto the spray suppression uh, just to, you know, make sure. Because apparently, they sometimes they get a bit funny with super singles being wider than a standard wheel if the spray suppression doesn't fully cover. Um, the wheel, so he's added extra bits on there. Um, but yeah, apart from that, he said everything's everything's good. He said yeah. it looks like a pretty good truck now. Yeah, now, <laughs> now it does. Now. <laughs> so who enjoyed the little footage from our ride out yesterday? Should we do more of it? I booked my MOT for my bike, it's in on Friday. Oh yeah. Ooh. I can't believe I forgot about my MOT. Oh. Ben was asking me on the Saturday if I wanted to go out on the bikes and I said no because I was in a mood. And then the Sunday I decided that I would go out on the bike and my MOT ran out on the Saturday. How guttering is that? So that's two MOTs in one week. Should we vlog that MOT as well? Oh, my bike MOT. <laughs> bike that, MOT. That should piss it through. Brand new bike. Yeah. I'm less less worried about your bike MOT yeah. than I am for this. <laughs> Put it that way. Anything could go wrong, wrong on the bike ain't going to cost as much as a lorry. No. So we've been told to just couple up to the weight trailer. Which is that little What's red that one there. Oh, no. So bright. Drive. You didn't do it. Yes, I did. Hello. You're right. What? It doesn't look like it's on. It's just a big gap. Massive gap. Look at all the room for activities. It's got a brake. I can't find it. Is it on the front? If I find the brake, where's the 
Where's the park brake? There's no brake! Well, will there be somewhere? <laughs> Is it on the front? <laughs> so we're all coupled up to the white trailer. We found the brake in the end. Yeah, we found it. It's an old trailer. It's an old trailer. They're in silly places. So now we're just waiting for Mr. MOT tester to come and have a look. How so do you know it's a Mr? Could be a Miss, could be a Mrs. Sorry. Assuming. How, who am I to assume <laughs> their gender? Just because it's an MLT it right garage, do you think everyone's men here? Is it all right to say their or huh? their gender or do I have to say, is there another word for it? I don't want to miss gender. I'm not going that deep, I just oh. meant because we're at an MLT garage does not mean everybody who works here is a him no. or a he. But I'll bet you 20 okay. quid it's a bloke. Bet you 20 quid it's a girl. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> really? It's a girl. <laughs> Looks like I've just earned 20 quid. Because I've just seen him. Well, I've just seen a girl. <laughs> she done the last test. No, she's not the MOT tester. No? Mm, we'll see. So, <laughs> it's, we couldn't film in there. Uh, we did ask for permission. He, you know, he said, said no. no. Um, <laughs> So it was all quite eventful, really. It was, yeah. Oh, Jesus, oh there's a fight. a fight, look. They're on a fight. I love a bit of drama. <laughs> it's just been oh, stressful. Obviously stressful being a new operator. Um, the first brake test we did, Nicole did, and it failed. And we thought maybe that Nicole didn't press the brake all the way down. So then yeah. I tried. Blamed it on me. So then I tried. It failed. Um, so then they spoke to the office and we took it for a spin, warmed the brakes up a bit, and then it went straight through. Because obviously the brake test results pre MOT, literally days ago, were all really good. And then obviously we presented it today and they've it's failed yeah. just by like one percent so just warm the brakes a bit and that they're fine um but yeah very eventful and also um part way through the mot <laughs> i know what you're gonna say <laughs> part way through the mot bearing in mind i was stressed obviously because it just failed the brake test twice <laughs> and the mot man was stood right in front of the yeah, lorry when the mot happened. man was just doing the light so he's right in front of the lorry and nicole was literally sat in the passenger seat here and she's <laughs> she's fiddling with the the mirror up there and She's trying to adjust it for me. I don't know why, because I didn't need to look at them at this point. But we're adjusting mirrors for some reason halfway through the test. She got her fingers behind it and just pulled it off. Just pulled it off in her hands and then looked at me with it in her hands. And I'm like, are you joking? Like, do you want to try and wind me up even more today? Oh, so she just... pulled the mirror off halfway through. So then she sat here like this, just holding it like, the like it's normal. <laughs> the so MLT just man was looking at me thinking, what are you Why doing? are you touching the mirror? But I couldn't let go of the mirror. Because it would have fell off. Back on. <laughs> so then we had to swap seats and I had to quickly tap it back on. <laughs> oh, honestly. Oh, I'm hilarious. I really am. Yeah, real hilarious. <laughs> I've got grease on my jeans. I don't know where that's coming from. But listen, the main thing is we've passed. <laughs> we've passed now, so. What a relief. Third time lucky that was. It's been anxiety over oh. though today. And the mirror's on. Hopefully that doesn't fall She's off. She's pizza. Yeah. I'm Why starving. Not? I'm starving as well. But yeah. So back to the workshop now. Put the wheel nut covers back on. And then oh, I've got we're to away. stickers. Yeah, we'll have to order some new stickers. We'll have to get on a um, truck style, get them to make us some. <laughs> I told you it was going to come off. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. The new mirror. We'll so, just pass the MOT and it falls we'll, off as we're following. We'll go back 
to the workshop and, and get this <laughs> refitted properly. Um, not a lot we can do about it right now. I wonder if they fit this one on properly now. It was fired until Nicole played with it. <laughs> so yeah, it, the event it, it just keeps coming, like more, more stress, more drama. Whatever, what, what I'll have Did to I find it funny though? I didn't turn the camera off just in case something else happens. <laughs> what do you think is going to happen? The wheels are going to fall off now. I don't know anymore. So we're nearly back at the workshop now, ready to get all these bits put back to normal. But if anyone else wants, you know, something really stressful in their lives, and feel like you haven't got enough stress, just buy a lorry, because then you'll have plenty. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well guys, that is it. We have the truck back where she belongs. Um, past the MOT, which is absolutely amazing news because my heart was going a bit thinking that obviously we failed the first time, failed the second time, and then we'd done the brake test for a third time and passed. Um, so yeah, she's all passed, ready to go for another year. And then all we need to do now is on Friday take my motorbike for its MLT, which I've no doubt it's going to pass anyway. Um, but yeah, guys, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel to keep updated because we have so much work left to do on this truck and we'd like to take you with us and keep updated. See you soon.